Today's video is going to be about St. Bernard State Park in New Orleans. You need to watch all the way through the video. I got two great tips that are going to help you out. One is a 50% discount that you can get at a state park, which is almost totally unheard of. And the other thing is that there's an event here, an activity, just for the kids. So watch the whole video so you can see what these two great deals are. Here's a look at our campsite that we have. You're on the video now. What? You're on the video. <laughs> Welcome to our campsite. We're in St. Bernard's State Park in Louisiana. We've been here six days and we're leaving out tomorrow, heading out tomorrow. So it was a wet rainy day when we got here. It's barely dried up and it's gonna be a wet rainy day when we leave tomorrow. So that's Louisiana for you. So we pretty much haven't been here too much. We've been down in the French Quarter. Uh, you want to be checking out that uh, video of the top 10 must-dos and must-haves and must-experience in New Orleans. We did see a armadillo last night, and I got a feeling that's what's kind of... You can see some uh, digging. I guess it's considered our front yard here. I believe that's the armadillo. Wild boars would have made a little bit bigger mess. And we haven't seen any of them out here. We did have a lot of standing water when we got here. Nothing really too bad around the trailer. This area behind us here, it had some standing water. Also, uh, a little bit back here was a little spongy, but overall, it was all right. Bathhouse, we're really close to it. It's right here. Uh, it's got like uh, three showers in it. Typical bathhouse. Seems like they might only clean it uh, once a week, but I mean, they go in and they keep it stocked well. There is a laundry mat inside. It has uh, two washers and two dryers. So that works out all right. It's it's uh, electric and water here. It does have a dump station, and you'll see that on the drive around video that we have. It's nice that they have the uh, asphalted parking spots for your RV. Pretty level. We didn't have to do too much to get it level. Park uh, hasn't really been too crowded. We've had some visitors or some other RVers come and go, but overall, uh, hasn't been too crowded. Most of the people seem to be gone during the day, so that seems to be uh, out seeing the sights. This campground is quite a bit of a distance from pretty much anything. We're on the other side of the Mississippi River. You know, there's a couple of convenience stores that are close by. If you need something really quick, you can get, uh, there was an ice machine up the road, which was very reasonable. I think it was like a dollar seventy-five for a 16 pound device. So, or you could get a bigger bag if you, uh, bulk filled it. So they, we've seen a couple of those since we've been traveling this last couple of states. They've had that type of ice machine. So something to kind of check into. Uh, overall, we're pretty happy with the campground here. Uh, pretty quiet at night, not much going on. They do have a splash pond that you can uh, splash pad that you uh, the kids can play on. That's over in the other section over by the picnic -y area. They used to have a swimming pool here, but we believe, which we haven't checked with the office yet, that during the massive floods years ago, damaged the pool area and they haven't uh, redone that yet. But overall, it's been a pretty decent campground. Great for a state. The other thing it does is it does give the uh, discount for the national pass, which we saved 50% off of the price of our site. You have to do that once you arrive to get that discount. You can't do it online if you book it. What's that pass called? Uh, America the Beautiful Pass. There you go. That pass is the one that gets you the 50% off. It's great because that's normally a national pass, and you're able to get it here for your uh, state park here. So that was kind of a neat thing. I found that on the internet, and after talking to a few people, that's just something you need to ask when you come in. They don't offer that free advice to you that they give that discount. But uh, overall, we're pretty happy. So uh, if we ever come back to New Orleans, we'll probably stay here again. That takes about 25 to 30 minutes to actually get down to the French Quarter. It's about 15, 16 miles to get to that other side. Uh, so it's not too bad. We're okay with that.
right, we're going to go ahead and wrap this video up right here. So we want to thank you for checking out our campground here at our stay at St. Bernard's State Park in Louisiana. And we hope you enjoyed it. And it was a great place to stay, quiet, secluded, away from everything. But it was a great stop and we got a discount. So right now, if you enjoyed the video, give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel. We're trying to grow our channel, so please, please subscribe. Tell your family and friends about us so they can enjoy our adventures too. And ring that notification bell for notifications. And we'll see you all down the road. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.